Still tackles here for Barrow. She's left and right for Wood. Wood goes right to Jackson. Further out on and now Barrow going to be here. An acrobatic finish from Andrew Bowman. And after three minutes on the first real attacking set of the game, it's Barrow who will get the score. Dufre hands on to Davies. Davies spies a gap, half break, but Silver did well to hold on. Dufre finds Keys on to Widdup. Widdup out of the batter. Tibbs, Tibbs, can he get over the line? He has. Ben Tibbs has scored. After scoring a hat trick on this ground. Or at least a couple of tries a couple of years ago, Ben Tibbs open to scoring for Halifax. Back in the side and back in the scoring. Silver and Stapp putting down. Jufre comes back this near side. Keys on to G. Nice step from G. Looking for the offload, but no one there. This is good play from Fax. Jufre goes centre field to Keys. Keys throws a dummy. Big gap there. Will he just go all the way? Joe Keys, he will. And Joe Keys. With a captain's knock for Halifax. Brilliant halfback play. And Halifax stretched the lead out. Halifax on the quarter hour. Put down by Dufre. Wood finds Johnston, takes to the line. One ball out to Costello, further on. To Douglas, Douglas steps back on the inside. On the inside to Cresswell and Cresswell dives over. For Barrow's second try of the afternoon. Johnson the dummy half, hands on to making, throw the dummy. Chats three, fast defenders who put him down. 15 metres out from the line, last tackle for Barrow, they're stacking this near side. And they'll come this side. Johnston, chase back on the inside, looking for Cresswell. And Barrow have got it, plan move. And Cresswell's in for his second. His second in three minutes. Play continues. Wood on Johnson fires the ball out. It's a loose pass. Collected by Broadbent. Broken field ahead of him. Palifat scramble well, but they'll concede the penalty. First penalty of the game. Conceded by Fax. After half an hour. Perfect angle. For a left foot kicker. Which approves. O'Brien well, waits, hands on to McComb, McComb, good forward to the line, Sam McComb, can he get over the line? Gets the offload out, Lannan, still going right, Lannan throws a dummy. Still going right, Lannan. O'Brien oh, finds keys, throws a dummy, back on the out, back up to Wilburn Hall, can he get the ball down? Oh, just sure. O'Brien oh, from dummy half. The hoot has gone. Can O'Brien get the ball out? No. Desperate, desperate defending from Barrow to keep the half-time score in their favour. 18 points to 12. He is making and making. Finds G and McComb waiting for him. Wood goes left. Johnston. Alabama to Cresswell. Three on two for Barrow if they want it. And it's a strolling. The Matt Costello, and that is really soft defence. Five metres out from the line. Options left and right here for Wood. He goes right, Gillum throws a dummy. He's still going backing up towards that line. Now it's Gillum, the ball comes out, and he's rolled play on. And it is a try. Burrow do make it back to back. <coughs> And that is quite possibly the death nail for Halifax in this game. And the referee, he's going to show a yellow card to someone. It's Cresswell that's got his hat trick. But meanwhile, this drama as a referee has sent someone to the sin bin. It's Gareth Widdop who's been sent to the sin bin, possibly saying a word out of turn to the referee. Frustrations in the Halifax side boiling over. 
as Fairbank tied up in the tackle. 25 metres out, here's Keys. Flat ball to Lannan, and Lannan will just settle. He attack down, make some good yards towards the 10 metres. Woodburn all breaking late as O'Brien from a scuffy play of the ball. McComb throws a dummy, I don't think the back line will want it like that as McComb nearly gets over the line. O'Brien buys it to Keyes, Halifax have the overlapper for Yuzi. He goes out, Sorenstall, Sorenstall's in! And there is the response. Perfect timing for James Sorenstall to score his fifth try of the season. Well, Brian Waits hands on to Tangata back on the field and back in the action, makes some really good yards. Past the 30 and a quick play of the ball. Oh, Brian uses the blind side. Kavanagh finds McCormack. McCormack throws a dummy. Can he get through? He's still through. Ned McCormack looking for the space. Oh, great tackle there by Wood. But Ifax full of momentum here. O'Brien floats it to Keyes. Keyes takes to the line. Put down by Broadbent. Ballyfax right in the ascendancy here. O'Brien goes right to Fairbank. Further on to Woodburn Hall who drops the ball. And the chance has gone. Oh, how important could that be by the end of this game? Options left and right here for O'Brien. Goes right, goes himself. Adam O'Brien, can he squirt over the line? No, he's held up. Oh, in fact, still have possession though. The referee stopped the clock, I'm not too sure why. But it's the last tackle here for Fax. Fairbank in a dummy half, Keys. On to G, back out to Woodburn Hall, Woodburn Hall out to Solenstall, Solenstall's in again! And Solenstall has scored twice in five minutes here. Brilliant response here from the Panthers. And again, the team down to 12 men. Find the overlap on that right hand side. And James Saltonstall finally gets his century of tries in an IFAC shirt. And how important that try could be. Scrum down, 10 metres out, centre field. O'Brien feeds it to Widdop, takes the line, we'll burn all out of the back. 2 on 1 and we'll burn all, dummy over! And there it is! Halifax do score the try! What a response from the men in red and white! 11 minutes to go! And James Woodburn Hall's fourth try of the season! Could well! Bring Halifax right back into this game! Here's Connor Davies. Good run, centre field by the Welsh loose forward. Centre field, options left and right here for Fax. O'Brien goes right, finds Keys, brings on Tangentau on the angle from deep. But great shot there by Walker. They've had a right ding dong the last few minutes, them two. O'Brien goes right to Keys, throws a dummy Joe Keys. And again, desperate defence here from Barrow. O'Brien goes blind again. G steps back on the inside. O'Brien finds McComb. McComb footwork at the line, trying to find a gap. Is that McComb? He's still going, McComb. Can he get over the line? He can, but he's held up. He's, here. he's got the ball down! And Sam McComb! How oh, he's got the ball down! And he's now the match winner for the Panthers. Amazing sees here. What a try! And look what it means to those players and those fans over there! What a second half this has been! As Barrow goes short from the kickoff. Graham knocks it backwards. It goes into the Barrow man's hands. This game isn't over yet. Here's Walker. Put down by Davies and Tangata. One last defensive effort here for Halifax. Cresswell finds Worthington. On to Johnston. Out of the bat to Broadbent. Long ball out. So Stalls intercepted. He's caught the ball, but he's just going to keep it there. And it is at the moment that Halifax have won this game. 
Up your jumper stuff for the next six tackles, surely. Nothing stupid. And James Stall and Stall, another one. Apart from his two tries, had a mixed game, but he's come up with three big moments, the two tries. And that interception there. <coughs> As Connor Davis takes his tackle, and Ifax will just eke out every possible moment from there. Referee rules, there was a shoulder tackle rather than eye tackle. Quick play of the ball, O'Brien hands it to Kavanagh, and Kavanagh makes the break! Inside to Widdop! Can Halifax kill this game off, Widdop? Sensibly just takes the tackle. Last tackle here for Fax. As Widdop taking his time to get up to play the ball, it goes to Keyes. Keyes with the break! Joe Keyes is over! And that's the game! Joe Keyes! Who else could it be? With all the rumours floating around, Joe Keys, captain's knock, scores his seventh try of the season, but more importantly, it's a win for Halifax.